Hey, welcome to uh, day three soybean harvest. Um, up here, same farm I was at yesterday on the next field. Uh, we're running pretty decent yield up here. Better than I expected, to put it that way. Um, not normal, but a lot better. Uh, this is actually a field from last year on corn that we did really horrible at. Um, this year is doing pretty good on soybeans. I don't know why. Uh, so, yeah, we'll see how it goes. I got one more field left at this farm, about 10 acres, roughly, a little under. Um, and I got three rounds left on this field here. Um, not even, looks like a round and a half. So, yeah. So, stick with me. We'll finish this field up. predicament now right now I am up here in a field that I just finished uh, this last one you guys just came along with uh, I have another field up over that hill 
other side of this cornfield. And as you can see, kind of road in the way. Um, two options. One I've never tried before. One is trying to carry, uh, traverse this ditch up onto the blacktop and uh, head down about a quarter mile where I need to go. Or head back that way about a whole mile across country through these fields back behind my place down the field drive through the tight trees back on the gravel down and then come up the road. chicken down. <laughs> I didn't want to take the ditch. I don't want to bottom out the back back end, wreck something. I don't know what's going to happen. Never done it before. I could lose traction, slip, get stuck, or I'm going up and over and here comes a semi loaded with rock with a belly dump and he has no place to go. So not a good idea. So we're going to take the long way home what it is, what we always done. Too bad. Um, yeah, so I because I can run over. Um, uh, to be honest with you, it's uh, some really horrible corn. 
<laughs> um, so yeah, that's not a big deal. But up here is even worse. So we do we do have some tree trimming to do. And um, before anybody comments, yes, we can take the headers off, put them on the trailer, and pull. But we are within a mile from the home farm on roads we know um, so that's why we don't and we're only running 20 foot head so I can make it down the highways just fine we upgrade yeah it's gonna be a different deal we're gonna need the cart our bean head everywhere so it is what it is it's how we how we roll That's the bad part. Um, trees hitting on this side. Now my mirror's looking at me. So uh, I'm gonna go fix that before I go down the road. <coughs> so that wasn't as bad as the as the drive in. I really scratched this side. I probably wasn't paying attention too much. So, well, it is what it is.
is something we usually don't do um, pretty much because we don't roll our fields and I don't have GPS so going at an angle is a little bit different every once in a while I'll do it when I'm all by myself so this field I'm in now I am by myself usually I got uh, the other combine out here we just run the rows one goes one side of the field the other one goes the other one in the middle um, so I'm on the small field by myself so I'm gonna go at an angle just because I want to um, do something different uh, this isn't a rocky field um, I know that because I picked it and I dug it so I know there isn't any rocks to worry about out here so I'm gonna give her a try reset this for this field um, so yeah that's kind of how I can tell what we're running so now I, I just hit 12 so it's been <laughs> and I'm on the lower end of this field next to the down towards the road so everything kind of runs from west to east down towards the road over here and then so this is kind of the lower end and it's with as dry as we've been this should be the better side so um, I really 
wonder what it was over on that side. My uncle was combining over here while I was finishing up on the north north farm, um, northern farms uh, that we were at in earlier videos. So yeah, uh, moisture's good. Well, it's drier than like it's at 10. I like think around 11 or 12, but um, yeah, and it's still green, green leaves in here too. That's crazy this year, um, all over the board. So yeah, I don't know. It is what it is. So, hey, you guys that got nine out there, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm feeling you. Uh, so, yeah, this is a bad year for every farmer. I'm not, we're not the only ones. I know everybody is having a really crappy year yield-wise. This drought really kicked everybody's butt. So, um, hope everybody's trying to keep them getting their head, keeping their head above water. We're trying to do it. Hopefully we can. So, but, yeah. 15, 20 bushel an acre means that's tough. So it is what it is. So it's farming. It's a gamble. Some of you guys like going to Vegas? Hey, this is what we do.